guys, it's me, Carmen, aka the Woodland Poet, and May 31st, which is actually going to be like, uh, now I was going to say two days ago because it's almost midnight here in the state of North Carolina in the United States, but May 31st was, was in our country, National Poetry Day, and I missed it. So, and also, May was National Teacher Appreciation Month, and I missed it. I did teach, I have been teaching online, and I am a poet, and I love both things. I love the expression. I feel like I have a talent with words, which is kind of ironic that I have a talent with words as far as, like, you know, writing poetry, because... I have a type of dyslexia, which is visual perception defect, and it causes me to leave out words and transpose my thoughts and um, whatnot. And I guess that's why poetry is such a great form for me, because, you know, if you transpose your thoughts and stuff, it actually sounds more interesting sometimes. And I have made mistakes like that. It's like, oh, that actually sounds pretty good. So, anyway, so this is just kind of a... A uh, little video to honor all the teachers out there and all the poets out there. And it's a poem that I wrote called A Teacher's Love. And if I'm looking up, it's because I'm looking at the, the poem. I'm going to try looking to the camera. <laughs> Teacher, if you touch my heart, then I will hug your soul. Teacher, if you kiss my brain with your knowledge, then I will carry you with me for the rest of my days. Teacher, if you plant the seeds of, of inspiration in my heart, then I will be inspired by a very special kind of love. A Teacher's Love by Carmen, a.k.a. The Woodland Poet. I didn't know the microphone was right there. So, guys, this is me saying tschüss, ciao, I've been saying goodbye, bonjour, adios, bye y'all, see you later, gators, after a while,